Ross Cantor last out. The badminton winning combination world champion as a rider in 2018 with All-Star B. Now with that wonderful performance yesterday with Lordships Garofalo on 21.3. You don't usually in this modern sport get people so far apart in the final placings. It's usually decimal points. Yeah, 10.7 the difference. Tiny girl, large horse, wonderful talent, the pair of them. You look at this, you see I could have all three fences down and that would ruin everything. It's certainly a feeling you have as you face up to a treble, but only one went. Doesn't need any more. Now she can have one more. Yeah, 6.7 the difference. My maths is so bad, I think she can have two more. She doesn't need even one more. That's looking so, so, so good. Three more to go. Time-wise looking good as well. This for the European title. Oh, look at that. And Ross Cander's going to bring it home with Lordships Gruffalo in convincing style. And for the team, for the British as well. A double success for the British squads. There, Dickie Wager, the team manager. Delighted with that. 25.3, Ros Cancer and Lordships Graffalo will reign as uh, European champions. She adds that to uh, her individual title as world champion. Great Britain defends their European championship as well on 103.9. The closest team to them at Germany at 131.2. It's a big margin for a win. France in the bronze in the end at 134.2. But uh, an utterly deserving champion in Ros Cancer was absolutely top class yesterday in the cross country. Superb in the dressage as well at 21.3. She just adds the four in the jumping for a final score of 25.3. And uh, Britain will take the gold and the silver. Germany, the bronze individually with Sandra Alfarth. Christophe Waller just outside that into fourth place. It's a good showing for them and for France as well in fifth and sixth individually too. And the uh, home nation will uh, bring home a bronze.